Anyone that attended the Vince Neil concert in Boone, Iowa over the Memorial Day weekend deserves a refund. This is the Rock and Roll Weatherman. My name is Sean Morrison. It's that simple. Vince Neil was doing a solo show. Also on the bill was Night Ranger as well as Great White. I'll get to them in a minute. Vince Neil walks off on stage amidst the fans that he can't, that he lost his voice and he can't sing anymore. I mean, a part of Girls, Girls, Girls. And then, of course, the lip syncing chorus, of course, came up because the band start, didn't know what Vince was doing, and the thing of Girls, Girls, Girls came in. I mean, he was in no shape to do this concert. Fans paid money. Some are, some people are asking why fans would waste their money on Vince Neil. Some money, some will go out just to he, 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 have a good time to he, hear a Molly Crew song, even though it's not done properly 90% of the time. That's unfortunately how it goes. Now, after watching this video from the Boone, Iowa, Iowa show, from the little um, festival that it was, Vince was in no shape to perform. Apparently, he was getting in shape for the stadium tour that Motley Crue was going to be doing with um, Def Leppard, Poison, and Joan Jett. It was supposed to happen in 2020. Then, of course, because the pandemic it got rescheduled to this year. And now, since things are just about to open up, certain markets weren't ready, so it's being delayed to 2022. So he was supposed to already be in shape for this tour. Unfortunately, he's not. It's, it's a very sad situation. Honestly, Vince Neil needs to get his act together. That's the opinion of Mr. Morrison. No reason to call, you know, people are going to be calling Vince Neil names. I, I'm not even going to get into that because it's it's disgusting, you know. Guy needs help, you know. Don't have to, like, change um, his um songs to um other words just to, um, just, just, just to, to bash on him because of how he looks. But besides the point to go on to for him to go out and perform and embarrass himself is another thing. And for fans to have to waste money on it is ridiculous. And with Night Ranger performing five covers during their set is, is even more insane. But they've been doing that for a while. I understand that um Jack Blade was in damn Yankees, but give the damn Yankee songs a rest every night. I can see you doing one once in a while. That's besides the point. You know, Great White, of course, they have their current singer, Mitch Beloy. No, nothing wrong with them. They went and did their show. Okay. But regarding the fans that paid money to go see Vince Neil, simply demand a refund from the, from the venue. If they refuse a refund, dispute it on your credit card. Take legal action because you shouldn't be paying... Ridiculous money after getting gypped. If you're not subscribed to the Sean Morrison YouTube channel, please do so. Everyone else out there that is subscribed, thank you very much for your continued love, honor, and support. If Vince Neil continues to act this way, another advice from Mr. Morrison is those that have tickets for the um, stadium tour, maybe you should sell them before it's too late because there is no way Vince Neil is going to perform that well with Molly Crew with the shit show that he did on Memorial Day weekend, which was, I believe, May 29th, because it was a Saturday in um, Boone, Iowa. It's totally disgusting to, you know, not being able to remember the words, the songs that you wrote and sung over the years, having lyrics on the stage, and then telling the fans you lost your voice, good night, and you walk out. It was the 14th song of the set, at least. I'll give him that. But if this would have happened the third or fourth song of the set, he would have did that. He would have, People would have been more pissed off. But still, dispute it with your credit card company. Get a fucking refund. And Vince, that, and Vince Neil, please, get your act together. Because if he doesn't get his act together, the stadium tour is going to become a stadium bust. Shame. Shame, shame.